What's happened everybody, it's G42 time. So we've got the G42 M240i that we own and it's our shop car, um, wrapped in era green by Nosetech. Got loads of MHC carbon and a load of goodies. Um, it's currently dropped on IBAC springs, but today we are swapping up to the MMR. So it's almost track season. It's time that we're gonna be building this car to a bit of a, bit of a monster in terms of power and what we're doing with it. So we've opted to change over to the MSS sp springs they're adjustable, that way we can corner weight the car and get it properly geo set up without having to change to a coilover because we're trying to maintain the cost on this car to kind of do things that are kind of cost effective um, rather than doing a full V4 KW setup that we might do on like an M3 for example. But yeah, we won't talk too much more, we'll go over to the workbench and unwrap these now. Yeah. All right, what's happening we are now on the workshop, so this video is obviously sponsored by Boxo, so shout out to Boxo UK for sponsoring our workshop, providing us with some of the baddest tools in the game. Fitted out, everywhere we look, we've got all you need, 116 screwdrivers. Um, anyways, so let's talk MSS. So as always, beautifully packed. Let's open that up there. Um, and let's walk from left to right, what's inside the box. So we've got an instruction manual um, with quite a unique kind of looking C-spanner, which is quite nice. Um, and some details probably to a fitting guide. Um, springs, you've got the rear suspension kind of assembly here. You've got the adjustable collar. Um, and the small spring, which goes like so. Moving on, you've then got both springs assemblies here. You've got the front and the rear. We'll just stack it like that for the moment. Um, so that's the rear there. You then got the front, you then have another spring assembly, and then you've got some goodies in this box. So you've got the front adjustable collars. Um, so pretty much all you're gonna be doing is replacing the current springs with these, as well as the adjustable collars, and then you can adjust the ride height. Um, so that goes like so. Um, you then got these to be replaced on the stock struts so you can get the um, bottom of the spring sitting really nice. Um, you've got new bump stops, uh, everything times two, and that's pretty much what's in the box. As always, the quality is unbelievable. The packaging is unbelievable. As you can see, when it comes, it looks amazing um so yeah let's uh get this on the car i'm dying to see how it looks i'm looking to kind of drop it just a quick one what i like to do here um with all the adjustable collars i'm going to drop this to about four about let's say five millimeters gap um i don't like over tightening them otherwise you can't tighten them back out so try not to do that just leave a little gap in there install them adjust the ride height from there um and then what we will do is corner weight it long term and then adjust everything accordingly um, to get the weighting correct. But yeah, I'm going to let Dylan get some cool content now and then get this car on the road. everybody we are now out and finally we are out on some b roads we are in zach's beautiful 240i um dylan's just hooked me up with some gopros and we are now testing these mss so it's a dry yet moist day here in london um but we're out in the sticks and we're in the 240i and i can't wait it's been a while since i've been out in this car uh, to be totally honest zach's been uh Bunching the old miles in it, that's for sure. Um, so yeah, we're out. Oh, it's actually such a good car. I feel like Archie Hamilton right now. Um, but, oh, the pub, I'd love to stick a pint. Um, but yeah, let's talk. So MSSs have just been fitted, well, been fitted about a month ago now. Um, so they're well settled in. They've got, they're kind of used to it. I think we've adjusted them once or twice for Zach um, to get the ride height right. And um, he's so far said they've been much better for this than the springs. so well so uh, the the road just went like nuts over there um, and of course the MSS's have accepted that like no other um, so we come through here um, but yeah the car has actually been taken back to stock because we are doing a new 
2023 kind of summer show season look on it. Um, we've got actually going back to the Miltech after the R44 system. So a few little changes, but we still got the MST. Um, no engine tune, we've taken off the race chip and we're going for a Tom Wrigley map. So there's loads of development happening on the performance of this car. That's my next thing you might see on other cars. We've got currently the uh, European's fastest G80. Uh, we've got my F80 M3 that's just had hybrids um, and some other fun stuff because styling is our passion, um, but performance is something that we have lacked on for the last year or so. It's now time. But yeah, MSS's, we're on these B roads. He's low grip, he's putting down the power like no other. Just got a cyclist obviously take, making the most out of the Friday afternoon B roads. Um, but she should hopefully veer off in a moment. Um, and I'll just do a U turn and then hit this road back up here. But MSS's, the pros are that there's dual spring rate on the rear. So you've got a bit of comfort um, and you've got comfort and then when you push hard you then get the performance side of, of them come in to play i'm just gonna say intake sound let me drop the window and a bit of low grip coming through here wow get a bit of air even it feels like all right this is the perfect opportunity to test the springs we're going changing the grip positions Got a little car, of course. As you're having a good hoon, you always find the cars. There's Rinse it for Zach. So when it's when you're hitting those bumps, it's, it's, it's taking them quite well, uh, which is quite good. And then obviously I can pop straight back into comfort out of the adaptive suspension and be back into my comfort. Oh, shit, this thing is off. Um, so yeah, uh, back to the MSS. So it's a single spring on the on the front, single spring rate. It's a dual spring rate on the rear. Both adjustable on the collars. So you can adjust the ride height, get exactly how you want it. You can adjust the rake um, to really optimize the performance of the original shock absorbers um, you can also go on to upgrade the shock absorbers and run the MSS so like go for a Bilstein shot and then go for the MSS and that is a killer combo so little things like that is really cool to do um, Dylan, Dylan's just doing some B-roll, just or well, just doing flybys. I'm gonna try and get this thing sideways. Um, let's get the traction off. <laughs> you know, I think MSS is one of the best options on the market. I haven't seen Haas bring out a kit. KW has kit for the G42 yet, um, which is a competitor obviously for the MSS suspension. Um, but again, made in Britain, designed, engineered in Britain. Some really good pros to the kit. Let's get it here. There we go, we got a nice little slide. Let's see if it didn't saw that. Um, but made in Britain, engineered in Britain, and what a great product overall. Available throughout the world. If you don't buy it from us, buy it from one of our friendly fellows across the globe. Um, and yeah, let us know if you have any questions. Zach is a great person to chat to in terms of things uh, for this suspension. But anyways, guys and girls, hope you enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, hit that bell button, wait for the next one.